Okay guys, so lesson number three, uh, chapter four. And in this lesson, we're going to learn the song With or Without You by U2. And we are going to put into practice uh, what we've learned uh, from previous lessons. Uh, the eighth note that we've learned, we're going to put it into practice here. Uh, the plucking, the alternate plucking with your um, index and middle finger. We're going to put it into practice. And then I'm going to teach you about shapes. Instead of looking at it as a chord progression, we're going to look at it as a shape. And then we're going to be focusing on the counting. Uh, so metronome is a big help as well if you got one. And also if you got looper, it's nice to jump and loop this one because the entire song, uh, the bass line is just uh, almost the same. Um, and also in preparation, uh, like for example, in the future you are going to be recording and you need to have that steady uh, bass line. Right, let's crack on. So the chord progression for this one, we are on the key of D. So this is our one. And then we are going to the fifth, which is A. So one, two, three, four, five. Five is A, but we're going to use the lower octave. So D and then goes to A. And then sixth, which is B minor. And then fourth, which is G, and goes back to the root, which is D. Now the uh, beat or the notes that we're going to be using is eight note. So one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one, two and three and four. You can do, you can practice with that alternate as well, plucking. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one, two and three and four. Okay, so I mentioned earlier about the shape. So the shape of this one is T here, goes up, and then goes to this, and that one. So if you picture it out as a shape, it started here. If you're going to draw it, it went up, went across, and back. So it's like writing a letter T. And then back again. So the song evolves in that uh, chords pattern. And that shape okay so if you want uh, to jam along just type on YouTube uh, with or without you bass backing track so let's try one two three four one two three four last two three go <laughs> Okay, so yeah, all throughout the song, just do that T, and there's only one bit there just before the ending, I think, where the guitar will uh, come in. Um, that it stayed on D. It's like two bars, I think, on D. Then it just stayed on D again. And then uh, back again to that pattern, which is D, A, B, 
G. Okay. Um, that's it. And see you in the next lesson.